Are you filming? Yeah, I'm filming. Okay, come on. Lady. Now, we have snake's eggs. Snake eggs, that's right. If you've seen our other videos about snakes, um, you might know that I really like snakes and I've always wanted a pet snake. Wait a second. What is this? That is in my lunch pile. We found him again. So he is alive and well, even though I stabbed him with a pitchfork. Isn't he beautiful? Oh, wow. That's definitely a black rat snake. Yeah, I'll show you it. He's right there. He needs a good name. Oh, he's gone. We have eggs, and I want to candle them to see. There. Do you see that? Mm -hmm. That shadow inside there. That is a creature. That's an animal. An animal. Ooh, there's another one. Gosh. All right, so there's at least two, three, four. That one looks bad. Oh, no, that one's good. Five, six, seven. <laughs> I think uh, it looks like most of them are viable, Becca. We're going to bury them in a Rubbermaid, so hopefully we'll catch them when they hatch. Now, one of them broke open at the farm, Becca. Did you see it when it broke open? No. It was well, black. Did you? I, I saw the, it looked like, sort of like a slug or something. Drew saw it. Um, it did look sluggish. It didn't quite look like a snake, right? Right. But it was black with white stripes. What does that mean? When it's a king snake or something? We think, we hope, it's a king snake. We hope it's about 10 king snakes. If you've seen our other videos about snakes, um, you might know that I really like snakes and I've always wanted a pet snake. So I was a little excited when we found all these snake eggs at the Rhodes property. Um, we brought them home and we buried them in soil. It's supposed to stay moist and these snakes hopefully will hatch. Getting a close look at them. Thank you, they Becca. They look pretty good, and if you saw that video of a... I'll link um, it. We have a snake, don't we? Yeah, On we our do. back porch. We named him Legolas. Legolas. Like Lord of the Rings, Legolas. Legolas, yeah. I'm just gonna put a little bit of mulch right on top. Ah. And I think that's good. So we're ready for them to hatch and we're just gonna wait. We're gonna wait on them. Just sit it here so they don't get a ton of rain on them. And I don't want them to get out. I'm gonna leave the lid kind of catty cornered so we can see them when they hatch. If you like our videos, please subscribe. It's really pretty. Thank you.